Tonight, some coverage area teams battle it out for a shot at the All-A State Tournament. Plus, we'll head to Bell County for a Game of the Week doubleheader. WIMT's Josh McKinney and Jamie McCracken are inside the locker room. Welcome into the locker room. Another Friday night full of high school basketball. Jamie McCracken and Josh McKinney. Jamie, we start with our games of the week down in Pineville. A couple of 50-second district games between two schools that don't really like one another in any sport, Harlan County and Host Bell County. Yeah, no doubt, but I know Harlan County is looking for a win here. Start with the girls. They lost by 12 points the last time. Bell County's yet to lose to a mountain team. As we all know, they've only lost two games this season. Both were non-mountain uh, teams, but Harlan County, they've lost six out of their last seven on the girls side they need a win really 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 bad because really it's just been the Blair Green show uh, for them so maybe some other players can step up like Lindsey Branson and uh, Bella no uh, meanwhile on the boys side though that one should be good as well hopefully or, or I shouldn't say that should be good hopefully it's good because last time it was a 33 point blowout with Bell County losing badly hopefully it's better than the last time they played yes, that's interesting what note though on the girls side Bell County and Harlan County number one and two in the state in field goal shooting, Bell County 51%, Harlan County 50 and a half. Pretty impressive. Yeah, that's the girls, right? Yes. Yeah, that is pretty <laughs> impressive. <laughs> Some other games we'll have for you tonight on Sports Overtime. The 13th Region All-A Classic on the boys' side. You will be there down in yeah. Harlan. Williamsburg going for its first title since 2010. Barberville, the opponent, looking for its first title since winning back-to-back -back championships in 2011 and 2012. You know, there's one team in Kentucky that's trying to go undefeated. That's the Kentucky Wildcats. There's another team that's on the road to perfection, too, and that's the Williamsburg Yellow Jackets, 15-0. So, yeah, they're going for that 13th region all -A title. They're also going for a 16-0 record. And speaking of bad losses, when these two met the first time, 79-51, to Williamsburg coming out on top. The Griffith brothers scored 22 points, um, as well as Corey Shelton. He chipped in with 22. So Barberville, a big win last night, though, over Middlesbrough. 30-plus points for the Tigers, so they're playing really well entering this game. Uh, so it should be a good game down there in Harlan. A couple of other All-A games to touch on briefly in the 12th region. Somerset, the boys and girls looking to kind of sweep the 12th region All-A. Yeah, that should be fun. And then also, don't forget, tonight we've got not Central and Letcher Central girls. That's a Mountain Top 10 matchup. How could you skip that? We had that plan. And, and I'll be there. Okay, <laughs> have fun. <laughs> Head coach Dickie Adams and Jeff Cunningham should be a great game down there in Whitesburg as well. All that stuff and much more coming up tonight on the Appalachian Wireless Sports Overtime. But until then, we'll see you at 6. And Jamie mentioned the undefeated UK basketball team. Coach Callen and his Cats will head to Columbia 